Hello, fellow stackers. This is Cactus Jack, and it's good to be back. It rhymes, huh? Um, very clever. I haven't been, uh, haven't done a video in a while. I just um, kind of getting a little crispy, a little burnt out, so I'm just taking a little bit of a rest. Um, if you don't hear from me, if I'm not commenting like I used to, just just know that uh, I still love you just as much. I just kind of like taking some time. Um, so let's start off the video with one of my gaw wins. I won um, three gauze, and I won a bid uh, in Australia from Four Nines Fine. So that they're all on the way, but with COVID, it may take a while. So uh, this is the only uh, gaw that um, I've got right now that just came in, and it's from Silver Britches, which, of course, he sent me some stickers too. These are cool. I wouldn't want to meet that dog on a dark night. SB, Silver Britches. That'll go up on the board. One or both of them. So, look at what I won. One ounce, Year of the Bull. And, you know, that's something I've admired. I've seen it on other channels, and I thought, hmm, I really like that. But I didn't pick it up for myself, so boom. I think it was his 1,500 uh, member subscriber, Gaw. That's, I'm pretty sure that's why I won this. So anyway, that'll go into the collect. That'll never uh, get sold. I don't sell gauze when I win a gauze out of respect. And plus, this is a really, really nice round, too. Uh, okay, we'll put that off to the side. Now, some mail. Here we go. First one. Hello, Cactus Jack Swag. How's everything in Arizona? I just got some stickers made, so I had to send out to my friend, Desert Dwelling Friend, Keep on stacking. Transient stacker. And he can draw, too. Believe me, I can't even draw a stick figure, so that's like... That belongs in the Louvre, as far as I'm concerned. I'm so bad. And, of course, he sent me one of his cool stickers. He's driven by a couple of times, apparently. You know, what by driven by, I mean, like, within 60 miles of where I live. He goes through New Mexico and Arizona sometimes, so... Cool sticker. I always wonder what that life would be like, you know, the freedom of the road. Of course, with uh, the beer bug in that, it makes it a little more challenging. Okay, next piece of mail. <clears throat> hey, Cactus Jack, love the channel, brother. You have some great pieces in your collection. Keep on stacking and bringing the energy to the community. Here is a sticker for your collection, Will's Treasures. And here's the sticker. Well, you guys, you got some awesome stickers out there. This community... Everything about this community just rocks, you know. So, there we go. That'll be going up on the board. I'm going to need a bigger board. <laughs> so, I wasn't napping, even though I wasn't really doing too many videos or engaging with the community too much. I was buying on the dip. So, I got, I've got. i always wanted um, one of these. And I think I have one other in my collection. It's an older one, not in very good shape. So, I ended up with the Dropsies. I ended up with two. Why well, have one when you can have two? All right. Cool. And they have that little security feature on the back, which I really don't care about. I guess I should. But it doesn't detract. Some of these security features kind of ruin the looks of the coin of the round, I think. But that's not the case here. I really like that eagle. That is a good-looking eagle. So, in addition to that, I have some other... Um, buys I made on the dip, but I chose to send personal check, and you know that takes time, so I should be getting those sometime next week, so I'll try to make another video when I get those, and my friend Pirate Stacker, if you're watching, I'm trying to meet the challenge, my man, copper, this is a half a pound, just plain on the back, that's a nice looking, well, I guess you'd call it, um, what you'd call that, I, huh, Anyway, it's heavy, I'll tell you that. And I got four of them. I didn't take these out of the package yet. So four of these. And um, I think it was uh, SGOT. This is the guy who told me about Grim Metals on eBay. So I got it, and it's a good deal. I think it was like right around a buck, a buck an ounce, which isn't, isn't really bad at all. That's a good-looking bar. I guess you call it a bar. I'll call it a bar. 
even though it's big. And I like the sound. Clink, clink. And I got a bunch of these. I don't think I showed you these last time. So, and copper, copper actually, while gold and silver were going down, and again, I'm not a financial advisor, I'm not advising you to stack copper, but copper went up in price like 15%. Oh, I got these too. I got three pounds of copper shot, I guess you'd call it, of flakes, because I want to try to do some pouring with copper. So we'll see how that goes. So that's three and four, these are half pounds, that's two, so that's five pounds. Yeah, five pounds of copper. What's that, five, 80, 80 ounces? If my math is right. So, stacking it. And one last administrative thing. You've sent me uh, suggestions for naming the snake. And I think, I think we're going to go with Slinky. Yeah, we'll go with Slinky. Unless somebody has some big objection. Objection. If for other people who submitted names, I'm sorry if I didn't pick, <laughs> pick yours. Don't be upset with me. But I think Slinky's a good one. Boy, he's kind of scary looking. He's not a rattlesnake. He's a, I think he's a boa or a python. I always get them mixed up. But we don't have these kinds of snakes in Arizona, or at least in, unless they get, get tossed on the side of the road by an owner who doesn't want them anymore like they do down in Florida with the uh, with the big snakes. They have a problem down there. Another piece of copper. I like my copper. Again, not advising anybody to stack it because, you know, uh, how's everybody doing with the dip? Anybody panicking? <laughs> we were all warned by it. I think I mentioned in a, a comment I made on one of the videos that every professional out there, even Mike Maloney, the, the real uh, pumpers, silver pumpers, and every channel, I know um, Yankee Stacking and Uncle Sal and a bunch of others, they all warned us, you know, um, it's a volatile metal, silver, and it can go up and down, so... You know, don't panic. Don't, now's not the time to sell if you bought it high. So anyway, I'll see you on the next video. If you like what you saw, please check the uh, like button and subscribe. And I'll see you on the next one. Thanks.